If you've been around here for a while, you know that I used to keep a blog. And I'm going to link the post below last birthday when Ty promised me a greenhouse. Here it is. Well, that's her base anyways. If you're any kind of a creative person, you'll know how quickly projects can stack up. That new excitement spills from one project to the next. And before you know it, you've got your hands full. Well, we've reached that point in our summer. What's that you say? It's still spring? This isn't the first summer since we've lived in this house where we haven't had a toddler running around. Even though it's hard to believe that we're not in the baby phase anymore of our family, it's also so freeing to be able to use two hands to work on a project. So we are tackling all the projects. Like this fence. This is how we're using up all of the extra brush, the branches, etc., from our spruce trees and from the forest floor. It's sort of like a hedgerow, only messy. Artistic. It's definitely going to add to our secret garden vibe. So let me give you the quick rundown in case you're new here. 27 loads of old straw have been shoveled out of the upstairs of the workshop. 14 dead spruce trees have been removed from the forest, loaded on the trailer, and off to the mill. Seedlings have been started, garden beds weeded and mulched. We finally made a decision about the greenhouse. Not to mention, we've cared for and connected with our three children, held down a full-time job, kept the house running, homeschooled the children, remembered to eat, sleep, and breathe. All while trying to stay afloat in yet another lockdown. There are a ton of reasons why we decided to start this YouTube channel. I could tell you we started it to talk to someone who might be interested in listening about our creative projects and our love of history. Or I could tell you we started it to preserve family memories, like a moment in time tucked into an album. And though these reasons may be true, the final nudge, the one that ties it all together, is that regardless of whatever struggles we may currently have, together Ty and I enjoy capturing moments. Beauty, art, quirkiness. Singular moments in a loud and busy world. A funny thing happens when you lay a track over a series of simple moments. It's almost impossible not to notice the beauty in everyday snapshots. It even works on homeschooling days when we're all just a little bit grumpy. <laughs>